Hello, today I'm going to show you recurring tasks in a Microsoft project. For that purpose, let's suppose that you have training every other Monday for next four occurrences. For that, I should first choose a place where I'm going to insert that task. Let's say that I'm going to insert it here, go to task tab and on the task here I should choose recurring task okay so I will hit on recurring task and I will say training or let's say Microsoft project training I will say that it occurrence will repeat weekly on Monday and every uh, second Monday and I will say so here you can choose will it repeat daily weekly monthly or yearly I will choose weekly I will choose the day and the week at which that occurrence will occur and at it will recur every second Monday and finally I should say when it will be stopped using date or using how many occurrences do I have uh, do, do I have so for that purpose I will say I will have four occurrences because the training will be after four occurrences and I will hit OK you will see that Microsoft project here I have a tip typo so I can change it project okay so here I will see that I will have Microsoft project training one two three and four each will last one day from 14 when it will be first occur occurrence to till let me scroll to that task here uh, then at 28th of uh, March then 11th of April and then finally uh, it will finished at uh, 25th of April and that's it now as you can see here I put the duration was and is supposed to be one day okay now I will raise this and I will show you the second one which is much more common and I will say that I have meetings but let's say that each and every day I have 15 minutes meeting for that occurrence I'm going to go back to task and recurring task and I will say meeting I will say that it will last it will have duration 15 minutes and I will say daily after that I can choose should it be repeated every day or every work day obviously I will have a meeting every work day and let's say it will start after 10 occurrences okay and I will hit okay be aware that when you put occurrence and it will start uh, it will last 15 minutes and I have 10 occurrences then the 10 subtasks are going to be created with start not earlier constraint which is going to be explained in my, some of my next videos and now you will see that each and every of these tasks will last 15 minutes I for that purpose I change my time scale and I have on my middle tire weeks on bottom tire I have hours but I will have here I will say days so on, on the top will be days on the bottom will be hours and you will see that on Monday it will start from 8 to 8.15 and it will uh, 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 recur, recur 
each and every day here. Now, be aware that if I have a task, for example, which will start immediately after a meeting, for example, it will start be a, a, a one day duration and ta let's say it is task one. And let's say I have another task, task two, which will also have two days, for example, and the task one should st be started uh, after meeting number one at Monday 14th. Be aware when I put the predecessor here, for example, let me show you that meeting one will be predecessor. And when I go back, then my task will start, even if it, is, it has duration one day, at Monday 14th of March, and it will be finished at Tuesday. Why? Because it will start immediately after a meeting. A meeting is supposed to be 15 minutes from 8 to 8.15. So this task will start at 8.15. It will finish at uh, 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 5 o'clock, okay, okay, because my working time is from 8 to uh, f uh, to four or 5, and then it will start it again next day from, and that is Tuesday, from 8 to 8.15, because this task is supposed to last 8 hours, and it is supposed to start after a meeting. So there are no 8 hours at Monday, because meeting took 15 minutes. So after that, those 15 minutes should be worked on next day. So when I have situation like this, and I, uh, I have meetings and I have task after meeting. Let me show you here. Let's say that task two is supposed to start after task one. And I will say now 13, okay, here. You will see that it will start at Tuesday, but it will finish on Thursday. Why? Be because the, that task will start after the task one is finished, which is which is on Tuesday uh, at eight fifteen. It will last from Tuesday eight fifteen till five o'clock. Then from eight to five at Wednesday, and those fifteen minutes missing are going to be worked on at Thursday. So when I have short meetings daily, I uh, I do next thing a uh, 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 couple of things i have a couple of variations either i'm not putting them at all in my project or if i want to see those meetings i don't put predecessor i do not connect my tasks with those meetings because 15 minutes are not something which i will uh, miss in my task one i can i can work harder or whatever to uh, to make up those 15 minutes but if i do that as i showed you in my previous example if i connect task one with each of those meetings task will start at the same day but 15 minutes later and it will finish next day or next days 50 uh, and uh, the last day will last 15 minutes because those 15 minutes are missed because of the meeting and meeting was a predecessor hope this helps and uh, be careful when you are using recurring tasks thank you very much and bye